Welcome everyone. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you may be. Happy Monday, if you're watching this on a Monday. And welcome to Practical Self-Healing for Your Soul, Heart, Mind, and Body. My name is Alan Chuck. I am a Master Healer and Teacher trained by Dr. and Master Ji Gan Shah, the editor of almost all of his 29 books and serving wonderful people as your self-healing expert from the Master Shah Dao Center in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. So welcome to each and every one of you today. The focus will be, I think, a very practical topic indeed. How many of you have screen eyes? Okay. How many of you are spending too much time staring at your computer screen and or your phone screen? Okay. Raise your hand. Type a comment if you have screen eyes. So I'm going to try to give you some simple techniques, practical techniques, as I always do, for screen eyes. All right. So first, let's just do some physical things. You know, there are some simple physical things we can do. And of course, we know that we really shouldn't stare at one of these screens, like shortly before we're trying to go to sleep, for example, because the, the frequency, the vibration of the, the light is not restful, is not induce, conducive to restful sleep, to even going to sleep. And, you know, I'm doing this particular topic because I need it. I need it myself. As you may know, as an editor, you know, I spend a lot of time on my computers, <laughs> not only doing Facebook Lives, which I love to do, but um, editing books, editing e-blasts, editing PowerPoint presentations, editing text content for, for websites and um, scripts for podcasts and much, much more actually, testimonials that many of you have submitted about the power of soul healing, Tao Source healing, Tao Source massage and much more. So many of those things I, I touch. I, I edit, and the only way I can do it is by staring at a screen. I'm not going to print, print the text out and edit it by hand. No, that was even before my time, okay? So, and many of you are maybe addicted to your phone. You know, it's your source of information. It's your source of entertainment. It's your source of connection with your friends, your, your colleagues, your loved ones, and more. So if you spend too much time on your screen or screens, you know, let me know. Risto Risto says, I think I have them. And Diana, okay, you're always on the spot with your topics because whatever I suffer from, you, you may suffer from also. So let's do some simple physical things, first of all, okay? So even if you wear glasses, take them off and just gently, don't rub your eyes hard, of course, but just gently massage your eyes and the area around your eyes. Okay, simple physical things. Nothing to do with soul healing. Nothing to do with soul self-healing, right? And relax, relax the area around your eyes. Relaxation is a key for all healing, all self-healing. Now, stare at something fairly close to you, like your screen, and move your eyes around. Don't let them be static, okay? That's one, one thing that we might do that can lead to screen eyes. Is that we just stare fixedly at a small screen for minutes, maybe for hours. So, but move around within the screen. You know, enjoy the beautiful calligraphy behind me. Ling Wong, one of the first Tao calligraphies Master Sha wrote. Soul Light, enjoy the lamp with the golden base. Enjoy the beautiful yellow lotus flower. Beautiful pure white lampshade. And now look 
you know, open a window and look as far away as you can see. Okay. Focus on the most distant point that you can see from where you are now. Of course, if you're driving and listening, have this playing, don't do it, all right? But otherwise, focus on the most distant point. And now gradually scan the landscape, the environment outside your window, look to the most distant point, and gradually scan, focus, and come closer and closer and closer to where you are. And finally, come inside the room or the building where you are. And just look around. Look around and stop, pause, focus. Okay, stop, pause, focus. In the process, let us give our gratitude to everything we are looking at. The walls are protecting you. They're giving you a space to hang art, to put shelving up, the table in front of me, maybe in front of you, supporting your computer, maybe your breakfast or lunch. Okay, so come back now and just move, rotate your eyes in every direction. Go as far as you can. Look to the left. And hold it. Look to the right as far as you can. You know, we don't want tunnel vision. We want good peripheral vision as well. So these simple physical things can help a bit. Now look up. Hold your head straight, but move your eyes to look up. As far as you can. Down. Now rotate your eyes in a circle. Now go in the other direction, the opposite direction, clockwise, then counterclockwise, or if you started counterclockwise, then clockwise. Okay, so these are simple things you can do that are physical that can help you relax your eyes. Just to take your eyes off of the screen if you've been on the screen for a long time. You know, very simple techniques that many people have shared. You know, set an alarm. Make sure you don't not only stare at a screen for too long, but give yourself a reasonable time limit. And then when your alarm goes off, look away from your screen. Same goes for sitting down, right? We don't want to sit for too long periods, so set an alarm, and every so often, whatever you feel is right for you, get up, move, walk, do something else, okay? So now let us do some soul self-healing for screen eyes, all right? We're going to use four power techniques. Body power, we're going to put point one hand, the fingers of one hand, at an acupuncture point that is in the bone cavity between your eyebrows. Right? This is called the yin tang acupuncture point. And it is the location of, right behind it is the location of one of the um, five major energy centers that Master Shah has taught for the 21 years plus that I've known him, which is the Zhu Chao. Okay? That is a center for uh, mind power. The Yin Tang acupuncture point, which I'm typing the name of, is in the bone cavity between the eyebrows. So point the fingers of one hand at the Yin Tang acupuncture point. Now your other hand will go over the lower abdomen, below your navel. Okay, below your navel, the lower dantian. Many of you know the lower dantian, foundational energy point. 
Soul power, let us say hello. Dear soul, heart, mind, and body, many of you know, Shen Qi Jing of my eyes. Dear my hands, dear light, dear this number sounds, Yi Zhou, one nine in Mandarin Chinese. I love you. You have the power to heal and prevent my screen eyes, tired eyes, unfocused eyes, and more, resulting from overexposure to screens, computers, phones, and more. Do a good job. Thank you. Call on outer souls. Dear soul, heart, mind, and body, Shen Qi Jing, of the divine, Tao Source, all my spiritual fathers and mothers in heaven, Mother Earth, countless planets, stars, galaxies, and universes. Could you give me a boost also for this practice to heal and prevent my screen eyes? I'm very grateful for your love, your light, your blessing. So sound power, we're going to chant E Joe, E Joe. E, the number one, vibrates the head, including the eyes and the area around the eyes. Joe, which is the number nine in Mandarin, vibrates the lower abdomen. So we're going to connect through E Joe, E Joe, the eyes and the lower abdomen. And we're going to send light. Mind power is to send light inside our body from the eyes down to our lower abdomen to nourish the lower Dantian, which is a storehouse of energy, but also to dissipate some of the blocked energy that is causing fatigue, inability to focus, and whatever with screen eyes. All right, let's do it for three minutes. Ejo, Ejo, close your eyes. Ejo, 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 Ejo. Ejo, 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 Ejo. Light flows down. Light flows down. Visualize the light flowing down inside your body. Okay, that's that's an important detail. Don't visualize the light going outside your body because then you will you will lose that light. You will lose that energy. We don't want to lose it. We just want to move it to our lower Dantian because we can't have too much energy in that storehouse of energy, that foundation of energy. Ejo, 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 Ejo. Ejo. You can always chant silently, of course, as I say every time. Ejo. 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 So all the things we're doing together are, are working in harmony. They're joining as one. We are chanting Ejo, which goes from the head, the eyes, to the lower abdomen. Ejo. Ejo. We are visualizing the light, the energy moving down. Ejo, Ejo, Ejo. Our hands are directing that same focus, pointing a little bit downward at our yin tang acupuncture point to assist the light and the energy to flow down. Ejo, 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 Ejo. Light flows down. Light flows down. Light flows down. Light flows down. Healthy eyes, healthy eyes, healthy eyes, healthy eyes. Boost lower Dantian, boost lower Dantian, boost lower Dantian, boost lower Dantian. Relaxed eyes, relaxed eyes, relaxed eyes, relaxed eyes. Powerful lower Dantian, powerful lower Dantian, powerful lower Dantian, powerful lower Dantian. So just some other examples of, of affirmations that you can chant that actually describe what is happening in this self-healing process. Ejo, 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 
ego, ego, ego. You know, if your hands get tired, you can switch hands. Very flexible, always. Or you can just rest your hands. Ego, to continue to do the mind power. Continue to do the sound power. Ego, 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 ego. Okay, so we've done about three minutes. How, how, how? Good, get well, perfect eyes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, another simple technique is to use a sacred mantra that is the key mantra for healing all sickness, all conditions. And this is the Chi channel mantra, the major energy channel in the body. I, I was honored to teach part of the healing days last weekend, just this past weekend with um, Francisco and Henderson, and I was asked to teach the Chi channel. So um, if you missed it, you may know it already from Master Shah's latest book. Okay, so we're going to circulate the energy to refresh, renew, and relax and regenerate your screen eyes. And the channel goes up the central column of your body and down your back in front of your spine. Okay, now no details here, most of you know it, but if you don't know it, just follow the chanting and get. Tao Calligraphy Healing Field. You can actually watch an animation that you can follow and learn to do the practice. All right, so dear my Chi channel, major energy channel in my body, I love you. You have the power to nourish my eyes, replenish my eyes, restore my eyes, um, Relax my eyes, help my eyes focus, help my eyes recover from screen eyes, and rejuvenate and prevent screen eyes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So just uh, chant. If you don't know anything else, just chant. Hey, hung hung ah shi wong yo. Hey, hung hung ah shi wong yo. Hey hung hung ah shi wong yo. Hey hung hung ah shi wong yo. So many of you know the circle. Visualize the light moving up the central channel, especially when it moves up through your head, behind your eyes. Hey hung hung ah shi wong yo. And then on yo, it comes back down your back in front of your spinal column. Hey hung hung ah shi wong yo. You can. Use your hands to make the circle. Hey hung hung ah shi wong yo. 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 Silently, if you don't know the mantra, just visualize light going in a circle from the bottom of your abdomen up the center of your body, into your head, behind your eyes. When it reaches the top of your head, it turns back down and comes back all the way back down to make a complete circle, comes back down in front of your spine. Chant three more sets of two. Hey, hung hung ashi wong yo. Hey hung hung ah shi 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 wong yo. All right. So these are. This is a very simple practice. 
based on Master Shah's book, Soul, Mind, Body, Medicine, a now more than 15-year-old book, total classic, total evergreen that will always deserve a place on your bookshelf as the encyclopedia, the reference manual for soul self-healing. And it also is based on the Chi Channel, which is explained not only in Master Shah's latest book, which hopefully won't be his latest book for long. I hope there are going to be many more books coming soon because there are some in process. And other books of Master Shah as well explain the Chi Channel. Master Shah has taught the Chi Channel for at least oh, 14 years. Okay, So, how was your experience? Let us close with a blessing. We have many Tao Hands practitioners let us give a blessing to each other for screen eyes. Dear my Tao healing hands, love you, honor you, appreciate you. Dear all the outer souls we called before, please offer an appropriate blessing to every viewer for screen eyes to heal, to transform, and prevent screen eyes. Blessing starts. Down hands, 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 down. Source healing hands, Tao source love and light, Tao source frequency and vibration, Tao source transforms our eyes, Tao healing hands, Tao healing hands, Tao healing hands, Tao healing hands, continue. While I say a few words, if you're new, welcome. I'm very happy that you've come to this little session, this little program, little teaching and practice. But if you're new, you may not have any idea what Tao hands, Tao healing hands, Tao source healing hands are. Maybe you can feel something happening with your eyes, around your eyes, for example. Maybe not. Maybe you're just curious. You want to learn more. I encourage you to learn more. So much information on uh, the Toronto Center's website, on Master Shah's main website, drshah.com, drsha.com. And if you want to contact me personally through Facebook, Messenger, I would be delighted if you're brand new to uh, guide you more, to share more with you about this incredible empowerment to receive Tao Source Light Healing Hands to help heal others, to help heal yourself. Tao Healing Hands, Tao Healing Hands, Tao Healing Hands, love you Tao Healing Hands. Close this blessing for each other. How, how, how. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you to all who are Tao Healing Hands practitioners for your service. And I strongly encourage anyone who is not yet a Tao Healing Hands practitioner to listen to your heart, listen to your soul, and jump up. Contact me. Be very happy to to connect with you because we have a major global Tao Healing Hands training. It only takes two and a half days with some follow-up training and given the cir current circumstances it's all done remotely. There's no difference in the remote training compared to in-person training and so we have a major workshop coming up just this coming weekend, July 9th for a half day 
and then July 10th and 11th, the weekend, for essentially full days, 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Seven hours with a nice lunch break, of course, in between. So thank you, everyone. Thank you, all Tao Healing Hands practitioners. Thank you, Divine Tao Source, all the outer souls we called. Thank you, our Tao Hand. And thank you, Master Shah, the creator, the vehicle to bring us all this wisdom and empowerment, healing, and more. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Love you, love you, love you. Bye-bye, everyone.